hello and welcome back so in this video we are going to talk about the sidebar so while making the sidebar we are going to learn about the list groups actually how we can make a list here it is very simple you again need to make the you can make it in two ways the ul and the li or the div and the a a tag the anchor tag if you want to make the simple list so you can create it while using the ul and the li first i'm going to tell you how you can do this with the ul and the li then i will tell you how you can actually make them linkable so ul and absolutely in the ul i'm gonna put the li and here i'm writing top top 10 topics you know it's kind of sidebar so i'm making it like uh, how it should be some kind of categories or some additional link links at the sidebar so here i'm adding a class list group and here i'm going down space in class list group item now okay i have added one item i'm going down here li again and writing the same things here are the class and list group item and here top not top anymore um top 10 top 10 topics is not very cool top 10 softwares okay to use okay that's fine and here i'm writing here top or how to make banana shake no that doesn't suit anyway how to design a web page okay i have made two list items now i'm adding one more how to learn go language okay i'm going here the class again list group item again and absolutely it has to be like that and i'm going to the browser back there is a browser i'm refreshing the page now you can see that i'm just zooming out and i cannot see the text in a correct manner i'm gonna delete this both of them and saving it and going back refreshing now you can see that okay that's awesome okay so uh, it is looking fine to me now absolutely it's not complete now how we actually can make a list without the ul and the li it was important because sometimes you do not need to put the content with the link now list group again but here you can notice this time i'm going with the div so it's fine and for the next one i am gonna go inside and i'm gonna make the a tag like that and hash and the class i'm adding is list group item list group item action save it now here i'm writing top 10 softwares to use and i'm going to the next line and here just practice just do what i'm doing uh, when you write anything multiple times you absolutely learn it in a better way item list group item action here how to design a web page and going to the next one a again hash class list group item list group item action and here how to learn go language okay i'm deleting the above list like that and i'm going to the browser back refresh that now you can see that it is linked now when you hover the mouse over them you can see that they're linked and when you click on any of the item you can see that they're blinking because of the they're linked anyway okay so this is how we just made a very simple list for the sidebar now i'm going to add some content to the main content area and I'm going to do this in the next lecture. And I'm going to do this in the next lecture. Till then, stay tuned.